My name is Dr. Kenneth Miranda Jr. from Chicago, Illinois, and I've been following the Grand Master for seven years. I first came in contact with the teaching while walking down the streets of Chicago. I met a brother propagating the truth. He presented me with a book called The Beard and 66, and I've been following the Grand Master ever since. And now, without further delay, I'd like to introduce the Grand Master, Dr. Malachi B. York. Right? 
How is Jesus to feel like that? Don't always feel that you've got to defend it. Or step back and say, because they will throw things out to you. Actually, because you like to explain it, you can call it a thing and say, prove me, how, how what did it feel like? No Bible commentary can deal with it. What is it? You follow me that? Now, they'll say Jesus is, in the book of Corinthians, the branch. The branch is not the tree. <laughs> the branch, they call Jesus the branch. The branch is not the tree. They call Jesus the vine. The vine is not the tree. The vine is attached to the tree. The branch goes off the tree. Jesus' father would have to be the tree. And you see them all right. But they make his father a tree in five days of the Lord. Do not make any great in anything that happens. On the earth before, we need earth. The moment they make him a tree, they make him one of the things that live on earth and abide in the Lord. Okay, no. Just the thing. What you want to do is you got to stay right with them. Don't let them slip away with their riches and their fantasies. And don't let them get hyper. That's their best game. Getting hyper on you and getting mad. Don't let them go that. Stay right there. No, 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 no. Let's not get mad. Let's stay right there. Oh, that's a good point you brought up. Let's go where that. Let's don't go nowhere else. And Jesus was talking, and they said they have a garden for the talking snake. Put the two of y'all in. Don't eat these two trees. Because when he came back, he said, what did he do? You know, when he said that, so he said, what garden does he do? Yeah, but he created this nice thing and took a But why did he let the devil go in there? But why did he let the devil go in there? Why did he let the devil go in there? Wait a minute. This is supposed to be the God. I'm with you. I'm saying why did he let the devil go in Why did God let the devil get to eat? Well, he made him talk and put him to eat. Why? Why? Don't we know? He's God. God knows him. God has to see what he wants to do. But thank God that required his son to be there. Why? Well, here, 2,000 years. I don't know. I'm saying, when we talk to them, what we don't do enough of is say to them, why? Why did God have his son crucified? Oh, they say, well, why? No, why? They got to go ask why. Why? Why did God want to say, well? Why? God knows what? Why did he come? And 
according to the scripture. Right? That's right. So Jesus is going to be a grown man. Now we're asking again, what was Jesus' purpose for coming to earth? <coughs> but to die before the cross for our sins, that we all may be saved. Okay, good. So why, that's good. Why, how is he going to do that? By dying? But he died. The, uh, the, ultimate, the ultimate point in Jesus is called passion in the Bible. The suffering of Christ that he bore a cross, went to Calvary, and was nailed to the cross and died on the cross for your sin that you may be saved. That is the foundation of the belief. When you get that point, then you go back to when he was born, I'm saying, when you know these people, and ask them, if Jesus was born by God, would a predestined purpose to die in a man or a cross, and to resurrect from the cross, then again I repeat, Herod would not kill him. And I'm quite sure the angels would have known that. When an angel came to Joseph, from heaven, and then take this baby Jesus and the mother and go to Egypt and hide out until Herod died. Say with me, who is the giver and taker of life? Why did they have to wait for Herod to die? <laughs> <laughs> Why couldn't God just say, Herod is the way, thou And in knowing the song, it still didn't do nothing for you, but they were placated. 
going all the way down here, get to the hoop. Now he got to the floor, you know what I mean, dog? Next. Everyone in the back for Next. Watch it here.
going to happen in court. Why else? The British is in Africa. The French in Africa. The Dutch in Africa. What are you doing over there? We're such a diabolical, unorganized, crazy, destructive, blocky, nasty, all the names you call. Why are you always over there? Why are you coming to my house?
The Bible says, water on my head is going to get to my chest. That don't happen with people with chest to hell at night. Mm. Well, not mine. My head is going to sit in most movies, but brothers and sisters, we real have to hear. He can put water up there all day. And he don't part that deal down there. It's all just hiding the water in the head, and that's it. You wouldn't. <laughs> that is not written for you. That is something maybe you think Muhammad is in the way out. You understand what I mean? I'm not teaching my son and my daughter about any God or prophet in her knowledge like me. Mm. And that's not wrong. Mm-hmm. And if it's wrong, it's wrong for Chinese to exile Buddha. Mm-hmm. And it's wrong for Egyptian to exile Isis or Osiris, which looks like me. <laughs> and it's wrong for anybody from any other religion to have a God that looks like that. Now let's talk about it. What are the people? Have a God other than himself for you. Mm. What other people? Anybody else's God looks like that? Day after night. Everybody else is telling you got their own music, got their own food. Over here, it's not much Chinese food. Hey, right? We're going to buy some Italian food. We want some pizza. I like pizza. I don't want to stop eating pizza. <laughs> Wait a minute. Y'all say it's 
man and Eve were born 4,004 years ago. Mm. Uh, so how could Noah's time be 6,000 years ago? Mm. Then that sounds something like Noah gave birth to Cain, and the white man had a 6,000 year history. Mm. Uh, coming to India history. Mm. Uh, yeah. mm. Mm. Uh, mm. Uh, mm. We ain't got nothing to worry about. This ain't that this, this whole thing is just something in about you. There ain't nothing that we do to you that we ain't already talking. I'm gonna get out of all right, all right, my boy. I'm putting it in the other field over there. I've been around a while. I love somebody telling me when I see that in your house, it's broken by. Thank <laughs> you. 